but once the portal opens, you must not let him enter it. He'll be beyond all weapons then. Okay. Just give me a chance. When the spell drops, I will give you a weapon called Sunder. But be warned, you must only wear it with the glove called Wraithguard. By hitting Inar with the tools of Kagranak, you can disrupt the heart and separate it from the White King armor. Only then will he be mortal. Now, I must concentrate. Okay. So I am confused then. Because Dublin doesn't make sense because he only has a relation to me. He really calls him an imbecile. And I don't think Garrick had any relation to it. So it's, it's so weird. So f f I, I don't understand. Maybe it's like... God has preserved me. It's so beautiful. Maybe because me and Inara are so close to the altar, it counts for both. I don't know. It's it's so strange. So many years I've waited. Come on. Give me. Thank you. Great God. I have sent. Why is this in my inventory? What? How did you kill them before they interfere? At least with, like, Gareth gone. Yeah, see, so, like, if you kill him t uh, too fast, you're unable to grab the other armor. I think it, I think it actually, it goes by, like, uh, like, it goes by if Good. you kill everyone. You have the heart and the armor. Now we can proceed. What are you talking about? So what now? You must enter this realm and destroy the heart. Only then will the way close, and only in that place can this be done. Why are you popping up all of a sudden? Anyway, uh, how do you know all this? The spirit of my sister is the one who sent me on this quest. She was a powerful priestess, the leader of my clan. Oh, okay. Ten years ago, she managed to break through the barrier between this world and Yearn's perversion. She told me about the Cult of the Three. She is also the one who told me about you. Okay, so how do we end this? According to my sister, you must take the heart into this realm of death and find the spirit of Yearn. Only he knows how to destroy it. Yearn, he won't help me. Then you must find a way. It's our only hope. But to do this, you must trust me. Do you? Yes. You must don all the armor of the White King and have the heart in your possession. Only then can you pass through the portal. I thought the portal almost killed me. The armor should protect you through the veil. It should? Nothing is certain in life or death, but you must stop the White King from rising again, and this is the only way. Make sure the heart is in your possession before you equip the armor and use the portal. It's time for my people to be at peace. Will you do this? Okay. That was kind of weird. When we zoomed in, it kind of looked like that. It looked like a like a, a plank of wood. Don the armor and end. Okay. That was weird. I don't know why the ending wasn't voiced. It's, as soon as I didn't hear her start her dialogue, that's why I paused it. And ah, uh, Shadow Cutter of Draining. Cool. All right. I wonder what happens if you click it without. Okay, so we don't have the armor equipped. Doesn't do anything. Is it just because I don't have the Heart of the Dead in my inventory or something? No, I have it. Weird. All right, so maybe I actually you have to have the armor. Ah, okay. So you have to actually have to have the armor equipped. Cool. All right. Uh, okay. So Sunder does not like us doing that. Okay, fine. Let's go. Whoa, what the... What happened? Our health, like, completely, like, got drained. Hello. Yes, you guys continue to have no greeting. Yes, cool. You know what it might have been? It might have been me trying to activate the portal. It might have, like, tried to drain my health instead. I see, so it's like shuttle walk then. Is my health even going up? What? Oh no, that's not good. That's not good. Hello? Welcome. 
I have been waiting for you. Okay, so we gotta get good checks with her. Okay, so who are you? I am Summer Sky, sister to Winter Moon, and High Priestess of the Minmer. Okay. My people and I have been trapped here for many years, waiting for someone to free us. You are that one. Uh, how do you know? The veil comes to me in glimpses. Time is an illusion here, as is hope. Your presence gives us that. I will do what I can. And for that, I thank you. We have to get good checks with her so we can get Winterman as a companion. Uh, you're different than the others. My brothers and sisters walk like ones asleep, caught in a nightmare of yearns making. I managed to break my bonds, but that is all. Ah, okay. You have the heart and the armor. You have become the champion we need to free our souls from this torment. Uh, what can I do? Long ago, when Yurn made this pocket of dreams, he brought with him a creature of the old world, called only the Overseer. Overseer. This creature of the Alien keeps my people enslaved. Only one of flesh and blood can kill him. You must be that one. I will kill, I'll kill him for you. It is good. You will find him guarding the monastery. Destroy him, and my people will be free. For now, I will create a bridge to replace the one that was destroyed, as well as offer some much-needed help to you. May the gods protect us all. Uh, Overseer? All I know is that the Overseer is a creation of the alien and that Yearn brought him here long ago to trap us. Uh, the Veil. The Veil is what my people call that which separates the mortal realm from the realms of the gods. The Veil is thinnest here, in this pocket Yearn made. I can see beyond it, into what was and what will be, but only with extreme effort. Uh, White Guardians. There were those of my people that through the ages, gave themselves to yearn, body and soul. They are now our keepers. So the ones I've been killing then. Uh, yearn. Yearn is as powerful in death as he was in life. You must be careful when dealing with him. Okay. While he is not the White King anymore, his sanity was destroyed long ago. Okay. I don't think I did anything bad, but just in case. Yeah, so we're getting into the issues that I found when I first tested out the armor. Oh my god, even Last Stand's not doing anything. I'm pretty sure. Wait. Is that Last Stand? Yeah, even Last Stand's not doing anything. Huh. That's something else. Oh, you want to know what it is? I think the uh, the the mod or the the door did the player dot mod uh, attribute value or actor value, which unfortunately for me means that I have to reverse that through. I think I think you can do it through the console. I think I think that's the only way is to do it through the console, or you have to use a script in order to remove it. All right there, buddy. All right, Overseer. We can't get hit by the Overseer, actually. Because I don't know how much damage it does, but I think 65 is going to be a little bit too much. There we go. Perfect. All right, hello. My people are now free from the chains of the Overseer. But we are still trapped here. It is time for us to help you. Okay. Uh, I would appreciate any help. It is a comfort to hear some graciousness. Especially after what we must do. Uh, well, what are you going to do? Yurn's spell on the monastery gate is too great, even for me. We must all combine our power so that you may enter. Okay. 
Our very souls will go into breaking Yurn's grip on this world. What's going to happen to you? I do not know. We may move on to the next plane. We may simply disappear into nothingness. Forever. Uh... You can't do that. It is a chance we are willing to take. It will be up to you to destroy the heart and end this. Okay, that the world is weird. counting on you. Tell my sister, she holds all my love. Farewell. Okay, that is a bit weird. Okay, so I feel like the top one that I used, the dialogue cho choice that I picked was probably the best out of the two. Because I feel like it would have been more, like, mean to kind of say, like, well, as long as it works, when it would have just been much nicer just to say, like, well, no, you can't do that. There has to be, like, another way. And there is. Just let me use the Dark King's power. I'll probably break that open. No problem. Alright. Okay. But well, we're gonna have to go in here first. It feels so weird seeing my health that low. I wanna see. Does anything happen over here though? No, there's nobody here. Wow, that's interesting. Thought there maybe there might be like a chance where you have like both cat and Dublin maybe. You know what would be kind of cool, though, is if, like, one of the Guardians says, like, Cat instead, and the other one says, like, Dublin, it would have been really cool. So it's like they died, but they died resenting me. Which would have been... Well, I guess the one that you reject should be here, technically. Anyway, it's fine. Let's continue onward while we're, like, near death. Uh, I could try to see if this actually does work. Uh, player dot modify actor value health by a thousand if I can actually spell health apparently Let's see if we can do that Let's see if that does anything nope did I do I have to go plus health then no it isn't like the plus health Do I have to click on the character then? No. So yeah, so I think the console doesn't override scripts. You have to use a script in order to override it. Who are you? How did you get in here? Uh, calm down. Are you Yearn? 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 I... I don't know. I haven't heard that name in so long. So long. Okay, how long have you been in here? Minutes. Ages. It's all the same. Why did you come? Why did you invade my sanctuary? Uh, because I need your help, the heart. The heart. Yes, the heart. I can smell it on you. Dancing little dead one all scrabbling, scrabbling around my brain. But I'm not dead. I try to run, but they follow. I try to kill myself, but they bring me here, nasty, nasty little dead ones. He speaks to me, you know, just to me. His words cut like axe blades, cutting, cutting, until my tongue is gone and my eyes are dead. All right, I need... They come and they scream and claw and bite and snap. You feel him too, yes? Or else you wouldn't have brought the little star here. Little star? Okay, listen, I... Yes, listen, listen. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. What's wrong? The dead one comes. The one who whispers, whispers all the things I see. He's coming. You need to run. You need to hide the little star. Who's coming? I need He's to... here. Okay. Who dares disturb our sanctuary? We see who you are. Mortal insect. You 
I had defiled our armor and our heart for the last time. You actually believe that you can stop the inevitable tide. Huh, what? Sorry. And try to kill me if you can. You're making me fall asleep. You will learn the meaning of pain, mortal. All will burn. They're almost as tiring as Hermaeus Mora from Skyrim. Jeez, man. You talk too much. Then die. I wish that could happen. Huh. Well, that happened. Oh, he's he's gone. Well. So far everything seems like it's all working in order. Welcome, child. You have done us a great service this day. You're welcome. Do not kneel. So. I wasn't going to. This aspect of the three is not what it once was. My husband and I are shadows in the pages of history now. But you're Mara. That is the new aspect. The one who stands before you is far older, and sadly less wiser. Even as I speak, he grow weaker. How? You have defeated what was left of the White King. But he is not destroyed. As long as the heart remains, your world is not safe. You are not safe. This white king has grown petty and filled with hatred. Even as Silestar and I grow weaker. Soon the dead will scour your world. And then you must destroy it. I cannot. The one who made the heart bound a small fraction of the White King's essence. Bound it in mortal flesh and blood. You're useless. <laughs> to release the essence of Lorcan, you must go back to the beginning. You must find the earthly shell of the one who created the heart. There you must encase it in the temple of Bone of the Creator. Only then will the ending be revealed. Only the one who created it can undo the spell within. Uh, 